Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Microbiology with Sumi. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Today's topic is sterilization of fermentation media. So let's start with it. So introduction. Now fermentation. Whenever we talk about fermentation process, whether the process is carried out on laboratory scale or on industrial scale, there are three important basic requirements of a fermentation process. And that three things are fermentation organism, fermenter and fermentation media. Here we are going to talk about fermentation media. Now sterilization of fermentation media is very very important. So whenever we use a fermentation media, it should be sterilized properly. If media is not sterilized properly, it can cause various effects on fermentation process. Like media can get contaminated. Secondly, lower yield of product can be obtained. It can inhibit product synthesis or it can alter the product. And this all ultimately result in economic loss. So, it is very important to sterilize fermentation media properly. As I told you before, fermentation media is used on two scales, that is laboratory scale and industrial scale. And sterilization of fermentation media is very important. And this sterilization is carried out basically in three ways. First is autoclaving, second is boiling and third one is passing steam. These are the methods that are generally used in sterilization of fermentation media. Now types of fermentation media. Basically there are two types of fermentation media. First is synthetic media and second is crude media. But the time required for sterilization of these both media is different. Now in case of synthetic media exact composition of media component is known so sterilization takes place faster and time required for sterilization is less whereas in case of crude media exact composition of media is unknown and sterilization is slow so time required for sterilization is more here I want to share some important points related to sterilization of fermentation media. Now generally fermentation media is sterilized by autoclaving that is steam under pressure. But in some cases some components present in media are heat sensitive. Now heat sensitive means when, whenever these components are exposed to heat its structure get destroyed. So in case of such components like uh, vitamins, enzymes, amino acid. In case of such components, these components are sterilized by using bacteriological filters. Third, if the media is in large amount, then the media is sterilized in batches by passing through heat retention tubes. And last one, use of sterilization technique depends upon type of fermentation media. As I told you before, there are two types of media that is crude media as well as synthetic media and depending upon the components present in that two medias the sterilization time and techniques used are completely different or we can say the these techniques depend upon the type of fermentation media that we are using Thank you for watching my video. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.